the next voice you hear may change your life forever. This is the voice of the chaplain of a ministry like no other. Here he is, now making his way to the mic. Please help us in welcoming the chaplain, Chaplain Dennis Keith Hale. Well, hi again and glad of it. Ladies and gentlemen, I am Chaplain Dennis Keith Hale, and I'm here at the Lighter Than Air Ministries, a ministry unlike any other in the world. And here we are in our beloved Katati, California. Thank you so much for joining us here on the spiritual side of campus. You're going to need as much relief as you can in the next few days. We've been so busy here at the ministry since we started with our fortune-telling machine. <laughs> it's not really a fortune-telling machine, but it looks like one. And it's where we reach out to people and hope that they can enhance their own spirituality in their life because it's so important to success in life. But we must rise at this occasion and say how concerned we are. As you know, as conscious subjectors at this ministry, we refuse to go and kill people in the name of policy or anything else. We, we don't understand it and we can't, we can't advise it. Now here is our government under the leadership of Trump and they're talking themselves into a war that needn't had come. They've positioned themselves for a expanded role of the president, which is illegal and hope to wag the dog, if you know that term or if you've seen that film, where you have a war scenario to cover up the terrible parts of the leadership of this country. I'm not sure our Congress can do anything because you see they are also affected and corrupted. There are plans if the Trump fires Mueller if the Trump fires Rosenstein, if Trump starts a war, there are plans, and please avail yourself of these plans, to be out in the streets as citizens saying no, no. You owe it to yourself to do this. If you don't participate in this situation, you're going to wish you had, as our Young people are marched off to war as the military industrial complex helps us to wag the tail of this dog. We're being set up, ladies and gentlemen. We're being set up and it's dangerous. We're being set up by Trump. This is all part of a giant plan, him and Russia. This is the plan to cover him if things go down this, the Russians are here for him. I hope that if you have influence over anybody in your life, that you explain what's happening and explain how important it is that we have representational government, our House of Representatives, act before any warlike behaviors, before we attack anybody. It needs to go through our Congress, and I hope that those in Congress will not allow this behavior. So we're recording the show on the 11th. We, no we normally come to you live on Thursdays. But we have many, many misgivings about what's happening. We felt we needed to share them with you. It's very stressful. And if you find it so in your own personal life, we hope that you'll Go to nat the natural stress buster, our nation's very most wonderful industry, cannabis, and that we make the world of cannabis something even more nurturing and understanding of its power and grace. I think that we're all going to need some stress relief in the very near future. I hope that each and every one of you don't open a bottle or anything else that's terrible, but instead look to your, look to yourself and the beauty and grace found in magic, wonderful weed, marijuana, and it's pairing with music. Behold the power of music, for it is real. 
During the next week, I think we'll see some trying times. And if you're stressed out already, please don't let this get you. You'll have no control over it. And we need to, yes, be reactive in the streets if something comes up. But we must also protect ourselves. And I want you to protect yourself from stress. Try it. Try our perfect pairing of music and marijuana. It's nature's way. So until next week, and I hope this isn't a week that precludes next week, I would like to say, as we often do at this ministry, as you go through your life, I hope that when you need it the most, you find mercy. And as you go through life, I hope that you go with grace. Good night from the Light of the Near Ministries. Thanks for tuning in. See you next Thursday. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. We have just had the distinct pleasure of the company of today's new voice for peace and harmony in today's troubled world. This brings us to the end of another in the series of Waking Dreams and with it the cosmic attention of the chaplain of the Lighter Than Air Ministry. Good night.